So what are you doing to prepare yourself now for the storms that will inevitably come your way? A third lesson that we learned from the story is in the midst of the storm, I need to find a way to give thanks. And I don't feel like giving thanks. I feel like, God, you've abandoned me. Where are you? How did you even allow this to happen? I am your humble servant, and you've allowed this? But here's the deal. It's not because I feel like giving thanks. It's because when I give thanks, I'm reminding myself that even though my world is out of control, it does not mean God is out of control. And so after Paul encourages the passengers and crew to eat, here's what we read. Then he, Paul, took some bread, he gave thanks to God before them all, and he broke off a piece, and he ate it. And then everyone was encouraged and began to eat, all 276 of us who were on board. In the midst of the storm, Paul is intentional about thanking God. He's, he's finding the good. He's reminding himself of where his hope is. 